When we came back off of the, like the Blood Money and Massacre tour with 50, I basically went back in the studio, started rapping up the H and I C two project, and um, I caught the case along the way. I caught a case, you know what I mean? Where the police in New York, you know what I mean? They uh, followed me, followed my car, basically profiled me, you know what I mean? By following me, because I ain't even do anything illegal for them to follow me, you know what I mean? So they followed my car and they, they saw me make a U turn, so they all pull up on my car like two, three cars deep. You know what I mean? Out of nowhere, you know what I mean? After I was already in a parking spot. So they ran up on my car. They illegally searched my car. And they, that means they searched without asking. You know what I'm saying? They didn't have a warrant. They searched my car, opened up boxes, and then they found a weapon in my car. You know what I mean? So me and Alchemist got locked up. You know what I mean? And while I was in there, they tried to get me to set up 50. They pulled me out my cell, took me to a back room. You know what I mean? And the arresting officers, they was like, yo, look. We'll let you walk right now. We'll forget about the guns, forget about everything. If you be willing to work with us, maybe, you know, give us some information on 50 Cent. Like, I'm like, oh, wow. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, yo, this is crazy right now. You know what I mean? I was like, I wanted to hear more. So I just kept asking for cigarettes. I was like, can I get another cigarette? Act like I was going to talk. That's just so I can hear more. And he was like, yo, maybe if you just plant, put a gun in his car, put some drugs in his car, or set up a buying bus where he buy drugs off you, does he use drugs? I'm like, yo, these dudes is ill. You know what I mean? So they kept trying that. So I'm like, well, I'm like, nah, I'm not with that. So when I get bailed out, I go straight to G on it. I tell 50. I say, yo, look, you better be careful. Who you let in your car? Who you let in your house? Who you let in the office? Everybody around you, you better be careful because they trying to set you up, son. They trying to use somebody around you to set you up. He's like, oh, all right. He's like, yo, good looking. You know what I mean? So I just been real vocal about it, telling people about it because people need to know what's going on out here. We got to protect ourselves. From, from um, you know, cops that do things like this. Because not all cops are um, crooked, you know what I mean? But you, there is a circle of cops that's doing foul things, you know what I mean? And I took my case to trial because it was a legal search, you know what I mean? And profiling. So I'm like, yeah, I'm taking this to trial. I'm beating this. You know what I mean? It's not the first time I, I had this t type of case, you know what I mean? I got a little record, I admit, you know what I mean? So I get to the court, and uh, in front of the grand jury, the cop gets on the stand, and he says, that I didn't put my hands up when he told me to, that he said he see me moving towards the box, putting things in the box. So it basically destroyed my legal search case and what he, the lies that he said after, with his hand on the Bible, swearing to tell the truth, the whole truth, telling lies to the grand jury and everybody that was in the court. By him telling those lies, it gave him probable cause to search my car, you know what I'm saying? And there's a whole bunch of other crooked stuff in that case, but it forced me to take a plea bargain for three and a half years. You know what I mean? Because I was facing up to 15 because of my record. You know what I mean? So it forced me to take the plea bargain because it didn't. I see when the cops started lying, I saw where the case was going and it wasn't worth fighting it. You know what I'm saying? Because I knew I was going to lose. Once you got cops lying, it's, you know what I mean? So I got to do three and a half years right now. Um, February 13th, I go in. And I doubt I have to do the whole thing. You know what I'm saying? I'll probably do short time. You know what I'm saying? But.